Hi, thank you for choosing your foodie. Today, I'd like to show you how to log in our backend system. When you confirm sign up with us, you will receive an account to log in backend website, a.foodie.vc. To start setting your restaurant details, select language you are prefer, enter the username, password, and verification code to log in. In the home page, you are recommended to enter relevant information according to the bar from left to right. Okay, let's start from restaurant setting. You can enter restaurant name, your restaurant address, and please click get the coordinates to obtain the precise coordinates of restaurant. The password setting can be used by manager to manage shift transfer and password is needed to modify the balance of cash drawer. The next, you can enter owner name and contact phone number. And the follow is enter GSD registration number. Please tick the box if your food price are included taxes and service charges. Otherwise, those extra fee will be counted separately. As you can see the left side example, but if untick, and you will be get the right side example, which is the total bill with extra service charge. And follow by setting to enter the number of charges. Next is print item code on kitchen bill. You should tick yes. If you need to show item code on kitchen bill and order list. If you tick yes, as you can see the left side example include the item code. But if untick, and your kitchen bill will not be print item code just like the right side example and print notice if change table, you should tick yes if you need to be informed which table has been changed. No service charge for takeaway, you should tick yes if no service charge for takeaway. And print notice if order cancelled, you should tick yes if you need to be informed which order has been cancelled. And allow multiple recipe to order at the same time, you should tick yes if customer are allowed to choose buffet and a la carte food at the same time. Otherwise, you should take no if you're not allowed. Allow customer recipe to order within 1km from restaurant because normally, customer can be seen the restaurant menu through our apps. If you take yes, those customers can be allowed to order food by using app in the specified range of restaurant. Otherwise, they only can see your menu but cannot be ordered. And the next is a lock of view display on mobile phone. This option is to enable or disable call view function on customer's mobile phone to request for payment. And next is hide the prices in order list. You should take yes if you are not referring to show prices in order list to customer. If you take yes, as you can see the left side example was hide the price in order list. But if untick and your order list just like the right side example. Activate to print simplified summary report. You should take yes if you are prefer summarized report. Otherwise untick and you will get longer full details report for cash closing. If you take yes to print simplified summary report, as you can see the right side is a short summarize and the left which is fully details closing report. Activate to show a minimum of your amount. This function we are not recommend to open because this function will allow cash show to change the actual amount during customer's payment. Activate to allow customer order under guidance. You should take yes. The customer will under instruction to order food by favorite, portion, and side dish to send order. And next, you are able to upload your logo and signature dish as restaurant background photo. 
And the last is you are able to activate the member card. The owner can go to download our Your Huat apps to create restaurant member card. As you can see, the next is the manual instruction to teach you how can create a membership and coupon. And click save. Remember to click update data once your information has been saved. This action will be updated directly with Casher system as well. Thanks for watching.